There we go. We got it. Man, so I finally picked up uh, Monster Hunter Stories 2. How is that? How are you liking it? I haven't played it yet. I just picked it up today. And then oh, I was okay. like, I got home from my birthday trip. And I was just like, now I got to work. So <laughs> so you only had a chance to look at the box. That and, I mean, I, we had to put all the shit up from the vacation and all that. But mm-hmm. I'm severely you- disappointed in it already. So already? The outside, look, the outside looks awesome. But then when you open it. It's like, this isn't just this game, it's just Switch games in general, where you open it, it's all white, no manual, and it just lacks characters. Ew. It's really, really bad. The problem is it even has a spot for a, a men, for a manual, but there's not one in there. I mean, they all have that, though. I know. Apparently there's a 15 gig download that you have to do for the game. God damn, for a Switch game, that's a lot. Hey, man. I've been hearing it's better Pokemon, so <laughs> that's all I'm worried about. No, I'm strong. I got this thing. Don't worry about additions on me. <laughs> yeah, I think that her SP gauge increases depending on what Dragoon level that she's at. Mm. So, like, she'll start off only netting 15 per hit. And then yeah. when her dragoon level goes up, it'll increase. I think her maximum that she can gain per round is like 150 SP. Well, she's also one that you can put one of the items on that you wear. You gain like extra half more SP whenever you do an attack. Pretty sure you could just do that with everybody, though. Yeah, but she's the best to do it because like she technically has the best heals in the game. But she just sucks in every other aspect. <laughs> yeah, she's she is the first character I switch off. And then, like, once we get onto the ghost ship, it's just like, okay, I need you now. <laughs> come back. <laughs> I need star children. Come. Star children. That's the name of the move. Star I children. Need, it's a bunch star. of fucking, like, flaming stars coming down. What, was it Ace Freely that was Star Child from Kiss? Yeah, I think so. I think it's Ace Freely. I don't know. I try to forget all about a lot, lot, a lot about Kiss. I also forget how to say words, so been a long day we're doing a late night recording on this one no so he uh ace freely was the spaceman or the space ace okay and then you had obviously gene simmons was the demon Uh, chris was the cat paul stanley was the star child oh okay isn't that kind of the same thing though like you got spaceman and then star child no, that's it's kind of different. I guess it's a little bit different. I wonder what his uh Yeah, okay. So Ace Freely's makeup was like a silver star over his eyes whereas yes. Paul Stanley had the black star on his eyes. Oh, he was evil. He was he was the evil one. What do you nerds got? Everything's over. There's nothing the, Oh, well. <laughs> Glass half full kind of person, I see. Hey, don't get. Hey, yeah, there you go. Throw a hope away where it just fools. Ah, fuck this shit. Wasting my goddamn time. Whoop, see ya! <laughs> also, forgot Ace Freely got kicked out of Kiss. What? Yeah, you didn't know that? No! Yeah, so Tommy like, Thayer. Recently? Tommy Thayer has been uh, working in Kiss um, since 94. And then he made a return in 2002. And then ever since Kiss has been doing their residency um, in 2014, he's taken over. Where's their residency at? Las Vegas, where everyone does their residency at. Oh, I was just in Branson, Missouri, and like the Bee Gees were there. (laughs) Like, Like, were they permanently there or? Yeah, they had signs there. They had a residency <laughs> in Branson, Missouri. Branson, Missouri. Of all the fucking places. Gross. Yep. Where I live, you have to drive through an actual fucking super racist city to get to that place. And it was really rough. But Branson was fun overall. It's very old people. <laughs> stuck in their ways. Well, except with except that arcade I went to. We went to an arcade that was like ten dollars at the door and all the old games were wait, do I go I'm pretty I sure 
I needed to go the way he was in. Yeah. But was it like all the retro games, like the old arcade games, they were on free play, and then you had to pay for the pinball and the air hockey. That's pretty cool. It was really fun. I played a lot of Marvel. They had a Japanese Marvel vs. Capcom cabinet. Like the first one or the second one? It was the first one. Because my okay. team is Spider-Man and Mega Man. Mm-hmm. And it was like, Spider-Man and Rockman. I was like, wait a minute. It's still fun, though. I got to go... Uh, what's the... Uh, it's like uh, Magneto mixed with fucking Galactus or some shit. That sprite. The final boss of uh, Marvel vs. Capcom. I didn't know I that know. Magneto was the final boss for Marvel. Well, if you look him up, his name his name's not Magneto, but he looks like like a steroid. You know how like Super Shredder is a thing in TMNT? This mm-hmm. is like Super Magneto. But I can't remember what his name is. And I just played the game. Do you have new things for me to buy? Onslaught. That's what it is. That sprite is fucking beautiful. Yeah, he know. looks fucking sick. That'd be a big ass beat art. Mm-hmm. See you, nerd. <laughs> Got past him twice. I'm so mad that you can pass him. Oh, this is a cutscene. All right. Oh shit. Uh, this is when you fight this fat thing. Daddy Frugal's here. <laughs> so you're the red one acting like a prince. All right. Damn white. I'll read Frugal's. I think that's. There is one answer. And the leader of the knight, the the knights knight of our free for the bet. I can't read for shit tonight. After I mint you up, you have a hammer, sir. Like you have a mace. Lavitz, is this the head warden? His name is Frugal. He is so bad, even the people of his own country are afraid of him. Is this he not his own faces. country? You have such a calm face, and you are paralyzed from fear. You had, oh wait, this is you. You attacked Celeste, didn't you? I just gave them the order. <laughs> it's like the same shit. Why did you have Shauna take it away? I don't know. <laughs> what? <laughs> Emperor Dole said just to bring her back. The order was so trivial that I added the new one of annihilating Samus. Wow, fucker. Just, just wipe the whole thing off the map. Yeah. Frugal, unforgivable. All right, this is our first real boss battle. This is the good, good boss theme, though. Yes. All right, let's see. Does he resummon dudes? I think he does. Well, we're gonna find out. All right, so basically, Shauna is our item user for now. <laughs> yes, but Shauna, I believe, has like the highest magic stats outside out of these of three. Yes, out of these three, definitely. All right. So we'll probably let her use the burnouts then. Double flash. Uh, I that, think that dart also has uh, relatively high magic stats as well. Right, well. We'll try it out. We need to clear up some inventory space anyway. Uh, we'll try a burnout. We'll do it on... Not that guy. Oh, it will only let me choose that person. Oh, because he's probably stuck in the back row for now. You can't do anything yet. Oh, uh, okay. Ah, fuck it. Let's see if I'll kill you. Alright, what is the button? I just gotta hit the button. I need a cap! Oh, no! Oh, no! Did it not let you fucking... I hit... Alright, uh, I hit a weird button on my PS2 and it fucked everything up. <laughs> not my PS2, my PS1. <laughs> yes. I accidentally hit the Xbox button, apparently. Oh, no. And it brought up a window right when I needed to mash. <laughs> Fuck this shit. Touch. That's staying in the video, by the way. That's fine. <laughs> That's fine. Own it. And it's so so is this explanation of it staying in the video. <laughs> Such a whip. Hey, it's your turn. Yeah. Oh, he brings these guys in. Shit. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I knew that there was like an upgraded version of these fuckers somewhere. Oh, now you can also hit the back row, too. Alright, so now we can hit him. Yeah, these guys do a lot more damage than their other counterparts. Uh, I mean, the best thing is just to focus all your energy on one. 
one dead enemy is better than three alive enemies. Correct. I learned that from Darkest Dungeon. <laughs> That's going to be a showing up on this channel. So God damn it! <laughs> Holy shit! Oh, he also, fucking Chris Redfield shot her. It's great. <laughs> dude, and Shauna took it like a fucking champ. Like, I, no, she she went on the ground. Oh, that's right. This guy throws these out when he dies. Oof. Time to heal. Right, so I uh, take it back. Shauna has the highest magic stat in the game, followed by Mirror. Had them, had them mixed up. Oh, really? Okay. Yes. Oh, this isn't going to feel good. Boom. Oh, okay. That's the least powerful one. Okay. Uh, I need to see if he summons these guys again. I don't. No, think no, no. After the after this, he doesn't. No, you'll be fine. I would heal Dart though, but yeah, Shauna should be able to go again. So I'll use that to heal. Yeah, I don't remember if guarding uh, increases the your placement in the action economy, but oh, see. really? I'm not, I'm not 100% sure. I don't think so, but in other games, if you guard, you do come quicker in the, uh, the placement. Yeah, that sounds... Hey, I think that happens in Mario RPG. I know it happens in Final Fantasy. Did you heal the wrong person? No, okay, I healed Lavitz. His was down, too. I didn't see her uh, go twice. She's a fast little... She's Out of these three, she's super fast. Fuck off. The only thing that I hated about this game, and I don't know... I think it's because I played Final Fantasy VII first, mm -hmm. is that I missed not the weapons not changing when you equipped in new weapons. Yeah, I did miss that from Final Fantasy VII because I played that before I played this, I believe. No, I think I played this before I played Final Fantasy VII. God damn it. Chucking fucking rocks. Chucking boulders. Yes. Yeah. Two damage. Hey, man, he powered. He valored up. That's what he did. All right, it's time to heal Shauna. <laughs> and Dart. That's my biggest problem whenever I play this game is I try not to use the items. And I'm like, no, you should totally use items. Because otherwise, <laughs> you're just going to fucking sell them. Yeah. Oh, God. Sir! That actually didn't do a whole lot. Alright, cool. This warden should be dying yes. soon. Double flash. Ugh! This motherfucker just electroded us. You know how many fucking Nuzlocke runs I've lost Pokemon 2 whenever I fight a Pokemon that has self-destruct? No. It's bullshit. Gravelers and electrodes get sucked by Chode. <laughs> That's all I have to say. <laughs> <laughs> it's not usually Geo like dudes. a last di uh, last ditch uh, thing. It's just they randomly fucking do it. And usually I'm at like close to full health, so I'm not really worried. About it. Dude, with the nuzlocks, it's just rough. I, I believe it. How many times did you restart uh, Golds and Silver? Uh, maybe like in the beginning there was a lot of restarts. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, let's see what Burnout does. I don't think Burnout. Also, I want to see if I don't fuck this up again. There you go. Make that number go higher. Hit 200. Almost. Almost did. 25. That's not that bad. That's not bad. Hey, all right. Do it again. I totally could have turned on turn. Ah! Oh! That's my goal, is to get to 20, uh, to get to 200. Yeah, why didn't you turn on turbo? Because I gotta make it authentic, okay? No, there's the, no, fuck that. You're not allowed to turn it on when it's your turn to play. <laughs> I don't have a turbo button. <laughs> You're right, because I disabled it. <laughs> Actually, should have used a burn out there. Oh, Shauna might be dead. No, 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 leave, uh, leave Shauna to use it. She's got the stats. <laughs> 
All right. You cannot nail that fucking harpoon to save your goddamn I don't know why. I, don't, I gotta go a little bit earlier than I think I do. 